I'm, I'm, oh, you're live. We're live. Okay. We're, we're live. Who's live? You're live? I, I'm alive. I'm dead. I would like to meet you there. <laughs> well, thank you. Um, hello, everyone. Welcome to Third Eye Roll. We're live. Um, I'm just doing some stuff real quick. Uh, somebody talk about something while I. My dogs are losing it. They're they're absolutely losing it. The escape artist escaped. He jumps They're eight not. foot tall fences on occasion. No, I'm serious. Like, if you've seen the fence in Mark Anthony's yard, I'll fucking jump that shit. He was just like, boing! <laughs> boing! <laughs> it was like some was spud like, yeah. web. <laughs> like, Mark Anthony has to climb on shit to see over that fence. <laughs> you have to, like, go up to it. <laughs> you're, you're fucking tall. Little, little dog. You know, Shimo. He's little. Boing. <laughs> oh. Okay. Keep keep it going. Keep it going. I have a question. Um, is I I thought this wasn't Safra. Now I think it is Safra. Do I have the wrong character sheet up? Yeah, this is Safra. We are okay. doing Safra today. All right. <laughs> oh, what did they, oh, our other campaign. Yeah, I had Theon up. Oh, yeah. Also, I would love to go back to do that again. That was super. F I like literally made my character in like less than fifteen minutes, and I had a great time with it. So <laughs> I'm super down to play that again. Yeah, I had the idea for my character for a while. He, um, you know, I haven't even gotten to play a bard until then. So, you know, I love, I love. I love everything about Theon. <laughs> Theon's hilarious. I love the like sideways hair thing. <laughs> Bards probably are my favorite class. Yeah. I enjoy when other people play Bards. I would never play a Bard. I hate it. <laughs> Don't play a Barbarian. <laughs> <laughs> I forgot about the barbarian. I made Beefy Boy a fighter, but then someone was like, "You should make Beefy Boy a a barbarian." And I was like, "Oh, I didn't even think about that." But maybe I should just keep a fighter. What's that? You're you're welcome to switch it. That's fine. Um, cool. Yeah. Sorry. I'm just trying to get uh, somebody in to the room. Um, yeah, I, you said we were missing something, someone, and I'm like. Fuck are we missing? Yes, yes indeed. It is a little bit of a surprise. Um, but while we're trying to get in, um, let's just do like a quick recap of stuff. Um, oh, hold on. The announcements. Announcements? What? Um, Tatiana, do you think you can help <laughs> get the credit to it? Uh, I've invited them to the channel, and it keeps taking them to the announcements tab. You're muted. Well, they should be able to. Some Ooh. bitches. Well, it's because they need to do the. They need to like say yes to the rules. <laughs> um, <laughs> gotcha. Delicious, Mark Anthony. Thank you for sharing. <laughs> so, um, they have to, like, there's, like, the rules on there, right? And once they agree to the rules or whatever, it should open up the rest of the crap. Okay, cool. Yeah, they were saying there's nothing on the... the yeah, it's because, stuff. yeah. That's, that's why. Agree to the rules and you're in. Okay. Um, okay. The game master of this shit show here today, um, and we don't have anyone in the chat. Who else? Is that? Everybody, where is everybody? And why does Mark Anthony say game master? What is this? Oh gosh, Krabby Patty Burgers. Um, so they said that they did do all. Of Oh, 
In, in the meantime, I want to say hi to our friends who are here in um, the chat. Hey, we're doing a weird format, and we like it. And it is all because I have never seen them. Well, except for cannot be in person. So we'll be remote for a couple weeks. And then um, we'll be back. How do I... I need to change my name. You're right. Everything is frozen for me. Is it? Yeah. <laughs> Everyone's making weird, weird faces. <laughs> is it frozen? Maybe for get out and get back in. Anyone else? Not me. Okay. It's kind of funny I though because Crow is just an empty chair. I don't know if it's oh, still funny. an empty chair for you guys back there. Uh, no. Nope. It's because I right put my elven hood up. Ah. <laughs> <laughs> We're playing with a ghost. <laughs> I was playing with a ghost. I said, Eve, please don't come to No, Team Zara. No, no one. No one. No. Not this one. I expected more from my my queer friends. Come on. And everyone knows uh, Team Zara. There we go. Oh. Hey came back. Okay, you know what? I was closeted in high school, so I missed out on that. I appreciate it if you didn't bring it up. It's a sensitive topic. <laughs> how's how's everyone in the chat doing? I see we have our good friend Gloomy in the chat. Hey, Gloomy. Gloom, gloom. <laughs> We got people in the chat. We got the gloom in the room. Doing chat stuff. We are just wasting time. Wait, is it, is it me or is there actually like a Gloomba from my room? It's Goomba. Yeah, I know. Is there Gloomba though? Because I feel like. Oh, I don't know. Goomba. They have like a little sad, just like a little tear, a single tear going down their yeah. face. There is a Gloomba. It's the undead. Goomba. That's amazing. I did not know. The undead. The underground. What is it like dry bones? No, it's only in Paper Mario. That's why. Uh, oh, dude. Let's talk about that game for a second. That game was great. <laughs> Wasn't it? Apparently, yeah, they it. have three installments, and I only played the first. What? Yeah. It was a time. It was It was a time. It was, an, it was a special time. Remember getting so tilted that we couldn't finish that first battle and we kept like shutting it off and restarting it trying to <laughs> beat the first battle? Yeah, typical yeah. Mario makes you want to like throw the controller through the television <laughs> a few times. That's so awesome. I played. I was like, wait, maybe we're not supposed to win the first fight. I played like Super Mario 64. And then the next Mario game I played was um, Super Mario Galaxy. Galaxy. It was like yeah. the first. It was like the first game that the Wii came out with, yeah. and you know it was just so cool. <laughs> it was so cool. Like looking Mario back on it now, it, it, it was very gimmicky. Like, hey, look at the Wii. Look at all the stuff you can do. But <laughs> all the gravity and isn't that cool? It was awesome. <laughs> it was. It was legit. But like. I think they could have done a little more with the game. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. No, I definitely. Mean, Nintendo's a pretty uh uh mm, I I'm not a big fan of that company. <laughs> I've never heard anyone say that about Nintendo. Everyone's really? just kind of like Nintendo. <laughs> uh, a bunch of greedy bastards. Well, I think that's true of all three. Company. I mean, that's true of Sony. It's true of Xbox. It's just, the only thing it's not true of is your special PCs that I know every PC gamer is, and you know, out there on Twitch. There's a lot of them. So, like, shout out to y'all. You can special build your little things, but like, if you're gonna buy a console. You're giving. I will money say, to 
I would say PlayStation was the least greedy for the longest amount of time. That's fair. Xbox, as soon as they were able to, was charging you money to be able to go online. As soon no, as possible. First, yeah, and they were the first to really do the, like, the paying for, like, the downloadable content and, like, you know, not doing, like, a full game and then, like, two months later releasing, like, the downloadable, but, like, here's no, the rest of the uh, game for 20 bucks. Activision. You have to think Activision. <laughs> yeah. 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 That shit. Um, downloadable content is the worst. It no, but so mad. Nin- recently, I don't know if you guys heard about this, but Nintendo had this. So, keep in mind, I am not a news reporter. I may get some things mixed up. But the <laughs> the moral of the story is that this group decided to have a Smash tournament, and Nintendo and the official Smash tournament group said no you can't do that because you don't have access to our license or whatever oh yeah and that's just one example of they do a lot of stuff similar to that over the years Um, but i don't want to go into like specifics because i'm going to get them wrong (laughs) oh right now it's kind of a thing that we're going to be thinking about here pretty soon too i see mm-hmm. the face you have right now is insanely good i have to send it to oh, everyone <laughs> no uh, oh, i shouldn't have said it out loud <laughs> i think nintendo came in and <laughs> oh my god they are they're listening oh and now nintendo is calling mark anthony <laughs> Excuse me, sir. Uh, yes, Mr. Nintendo. Couldn't do any fucking shit. <laughs> How's the hotel, Shars? Pretty good. Good. Hotel living is pretty... It's actually pretty sweet. Yay! Yes! Welcome. Welcome, welcome. I don't know what the hell I did. I think I just made them, like, an admin or something <laughs> in this channel in order for it to because I think there's a different way that I'm supposed to do it and I have not touched this damn thing in so long. That's okay. Now yeah. you're a moderator. I'm sorry. Yeah. <laughs> That's fine. I think I made you an admin. <laughs> so there's that. Puppy on camera. Puppy on camera. Oh my god. She's like where's my camera? I'm not on camera. <laughs> there. Oh so cute. Okay, well, once Mark gets back, oh, the, and, and, and as Susan Tatiana, we're going to get started, and we're going to do some uh, introductions, then I'm going to do a recap, and then we're going to play. So I got DDoS. Yeah, is Nintendo, like, doing stuff to you? I Are guess. you okay? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, Pretty. Super smashed my internet. So my internet has been going out all day at my house. It's not there, so I don't care, but, you know, it's unfortunate. Well, how's everyone's day going? What fun games have y'all been playing? It's my second day back at work today. Oh, wow, yeah. December 23rd. Yeah, so it's kind of fun, though. I have been playing Divinity 2 and Tarkov, and Divinity 2 is awesome. If you haven't played it, you totally should, especially being D&D nerds. Nice. I, like, went into the office today. Gross. (laughs) At a two-hour meeting. Terror was there. And I was not at the office though. I felt real bad. Thought about it. That's very fair. I don't remember what we talked about because it was two hours. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, at that point, like. Yeah, I had a meeting that I don't remember really what we talked about either. It was super pointless. I mean, not pointless. There were some good points, but I feel like everything that we went into the meeting to talk about and figure out none of it got figured out i just love those sounds like Mm -hmm. a lot of the meetings that i wow (laughs) okay 
we're all here. We're all here. So we're going to do intros, recap, play, um, until that's an intro also. So hello, everyone. My name is Charles. I am the game master for the Chronicles of Sakura, which is a homebrew campaign that follows a homebrew uh, tabletop RPG that follows the rules of D&D 5e, plus some homebrew rules. Uh, and I'm going to be throwing in some one D&D rules as I see fit, because why not? Um, I'm just going to... You, right there. Hi. Um, I'm Mark Anthony. Yeah. I'm okay. playing Arterian. Minotaur Paladin. Um, he, him. Pronouns. You. Thank you for modeling, Mark. My pronouns are also he, him. No. Next. There's nobody next to you. On yeah, that's why you, you. That's <laughs> why you just go. Yeah, you you spoke, you go. Uh, I'm Tatiana. Uh, I'm also Mofonga Con Caldo on Twitch. Uh, she, her, Ada pronouns, and I play Lenora. Um, and she is a half elf wizard, and she's a child. <laughs> I don't know. Every I feel like every session I'm like, how old is she? She's a she gets, She's she a gets child. younger every. She session. gets younger every session. <laughs> I love that uh, that in both campaigns that have both of Paradise Rolls campaigns that have literal children. The person introducing that character always says, "And she is a child." She's a child. <laughs> I feel like it's important She's content. A child. <laughs> Just like a content warning. <laughs> Right. Exactly. Hello. Who's next? Uh, my name is Estes. I am uh, the GM when we do the Proving Grounds. It's been a while. We hope to see you soon. Um, but today I am playing Chadwick Walker. Uh, he's like a um, like your your stereotypical burnout friend. Um, but like instead of being shady, he's like super spiritual and nice, but not religious. <laughs> um, Anti-religion, if you yeah, will. Yeah, oh, he's like, gods don't exist. Gods in yourself, man. <laughs> um, but ironically, uh, he is paladin-esque. Like he finds the god in himself and uses that for power. <laughs> And now is you that way or that way. <laughs> Hi, I'll go. <laughs> I'm Natalie. Uh, I play uh, pronouns she, her. Um, I play uh, Elwyn, who is an elf druid, half elf druid. Um, she's she's my first D and D character, so she's been growing as we go and. It's been quite the adventure. I like her a lot. <laughs> uh, I'm gonna go. I'm gonna point up. So you go. That's me. <laughs> hey, that's <laughs> you for me too. <laughs> me too. <laughs> um, I'm Natalia, and I play Asashira. Um, playing warlock. And oh. like to take baths and sleep. <laughs> and be extra <laughs> annoying. Uh, yeah. Uh, pronouns she, they. Lay down. Down and then. <laughs> Zavi, go. Okay, I'll go. <laughs> um, I'm Zavi, pronouns they, them. Uh, Aegis. Uh, in this campaign, I'm playing Crow, who is a satyr rogue, and will probably try to stab you. That's inevitable. Yep, one of us, all of us have been stabbed at one point or another, I think. I'm not sure, mm -hmm. has Chad been stabbed? I'm sure Chad's been stabbed. Um, yes? Maybe? I don't know I don't if you can, I've if been, you've gotten I'm, through my no, armor I, class I, at all. I've successful. I've tried to stab you multiple times. I don't know if I've actually <laughs> got like defense or whatever, or your, your shield or something. <laughs> I don't think you've stabbed me. No, you're right. I, 
<laughs> I've never tried to stab Asuka. <laughs> oh, and Sling Shao, that's why. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> We're bound by the slingshots of friend of friendship. <laughs> yes. All right, Kara, do you want to do you want to introduce yourself? Yes. Uh, I'm Kara, my pronouns are they them. Should I introduce what I do? Uh, Go I'm ahead, why not? Uh, flowers on the grave or flower. Uh, who's the grave girl? Excellent. Oh, oh sick. A grave cleric? Yes. I'm looking oh, forward cool. to that. Okay. <laughs> I don't even know what the hell that is. It sounds exciting. <laughs> uh, it's going to be my first magic-based class I've ever played, so that's exciting. Oh, good. You probably know actually how to do that because I'm playing, <laughs> I'm playing the worst wizard in the planet. <laughs> I've only played martial classes before, so we'll find out. Uh, but flowers pronouns are he and they. So. Excellent. Well, welcome. Welcome to the table. I'm going to do a, a little bit of a recap, and it's going to be a, a lot of bit of a recap, because honestly, it's been a long time since any one has uh, gotten together. So, um, it's like a car or something going by. Okay, so, recap. <clears throat> um, a long time ago, at the beginning of time, just kidding. Um, so, our adventurers, here we go, okay. Let's see. Each of them got a mysterious invitation to a summer solstice ball in the main city of Portheim. Uh, they get to the ball. Somebody tried to assassinate their their high magistrate, um, who is like the person who's like in charge of the whole country of Laverly. Um, unsuccessful, but adventuring that he was successful in stopping um, that assassin. I'm gonna fast forward to some stuff, um, but basically they've uh, realized that there is. Um, an, uh, a secret organization known as the Collective, um, who, oh, I need to increase, okay, hold on, I have electronic brain expression, what am I doing? Yeah, okay. sorry, um, you are okay. cutting in and out occasionally, not very much, but. You know what, it's probably my internet, to be honest. It's okay, keep uh, going. Okay, uh, so, the, uh, the, oh yes, yeah, so they've realized that the collective is um, behind a bunch of stuff that's going on that's really not very cool at all. Um, and it, that includes um, like killing children um, and killing people, raising people from the dead, which is a big no-no in this country. Um, Unless it's yeah. hot. Uh, hot Gavin. <laughs> um, unless it's Hot Gavin. Yeah, that's a that's a point of divine intervention there. Um, so let's see. They've also realized that the collective is working with um, some uh, deities to corrupt the temples of the old gods. Uh, and so at the moment, our adventuring party is trying to track down and, and get ahead of the uh the corrupter who is the patron saint of corruption also known as kite and uh to do this they rented a boat for a lot of money and thank you ellen for supplying most of that and uh i'll get you back i'll get you i'll pay you back don't worry thanks for um, being the and... party's uh, guild fund bank <laughs> exactly when you miss a session we spend your money it's okay yeah. It's fair. it's fair. I'll be the sugar mama for a little while. Granted, I think that Elwyn had the most money. 100% she did. She's been hoarding it and secretly pretending she doesn't have any. Yeah. It, it, that it, is to be fair. To Chad's ears. It was. You broke it. <laughs> yes. Um, yeah, so let's see. Uh, they're getting ready to take off on this boat, and the uh, first mate, Hot Garen, went missing, and, and so everyone had to find him. Uh, found him. A bunch of sea monsters had taken him into their lair, and he died, and that was really devastating for me, because um, I spent a lot of time working on him. <laughs> um, if you want to see uh, pictures of these uh, people, they are in the character info tab. 
if you want to jump in. Oh. And uh, yeah, so where we are picking up is you all have finished bringing Hot Gavin back to life. You're headed back to the boat to sail, sail away. So, oh, you were singing. I was. I was literally thinking, if someone starts singing it, I will give them inspiration. <laughs> I just. I was singing. I think we were all thinking that. <laughs> I, I just heard kept saying, nothing. Sail away, sail away. <laughs> <laughs> I just was. <laughs> that's what I was doing. First it was that one, and then it was, come sail away, come sail away. <laughs> That's not the sail I was singing, and I was singing the, like, electronic dubstep. Oh, yeah. Sail! Sail! <laughs> yeah. I don't even know what that is. Like, no, I don't know what that was. But Catch anyway, you. I knew what you were talking about. <laughs> <laughs> well, I hope that I get the largest cabin since my money paid for the ship. So Ellen's going <laughs> to hurry along and find a cabin that the captain will allow me to have since she kind of hates me um even though i think she's gorgeous but she's just like no um she hate you what, what, we met on? we met briefly i was like with sadwick we were coming back to the boat we were meeting at the boat and then we had to go investigate because gavin was missing yeah so that's when i met her Gotcha. She wasn't, she wasn't into it, but I think she was more concerned about Gavin. Mm hmm Yeah. Hot Gavin is is concerning. Mm -hmm. <laughs> okay. Well, um, she's going to take you all to the boat, and she's uh, going to first help Gavin to his cabin, because he needs to rest. Gavin in the cabin. Being... Yeah, Gavin, Gavin in the cabin. <laughs> <laughs> it takes a lot out of you being brought back from the dead. <laughs> Um, so, then she's going to come out and, and say, uh, all right, time for you all to, uh, go to your rooms, check them out, take, take your stuff, you know, you can just put your stuff in there, or, I mean, whatever you like, but you don't have to, you can also just like stay in the ship, just like, don't get in the way, like, getting up is really kind of hard, um, it, it, you might get in the way, so, so maybe just, uh, Go on to your rooms. Um, the first floor down is where you will find all of the rooms. Uh, we keep the port side open for passengers. There are seven rooms on that side, and there are seven rooms on the other side. The crew tends to take the other side, um, and then we have the the bottom of the ship below. So go ahead and pick your rooms. Uh, you all get port windows, so. That's fun. And we'll be off shortly. Th thank you, Captain Silver Dagger. Um, glad that we were able to secure this passage. I will go enjoy the facilities. It's early in the morning. Uh, we're brewing some coffee, just so you know. Uh, That'll help. In in the middle in the middle of that floor, you will find the lavatories. You will also find the um, dining area and the kitchen. Help yourself. There's plenty of stuff there. Oh, here I go. Yeah. Um, this is okay. the first time we're getting on this boat, right? Yep. Okay, so I'm gonna say that Lenora is terrified. Okay. So she's going to look for Astra and just literally be Astra's shadow. <laughs> she like pulls like pulls a piece of bread and goes up to Astra. Like, <laughs> and she just follows Astra around. If you wanna be her shadow, you gotta look like the stars in the galaxy. I don't think you're up to the task. Yeah, that she is true. She just starts doing this right behind us. <laughs> <laughs> you get a couple of weird looks as you all are heading down to the to check out your quarters. But you find that each of the rooms along the side there, um, they're all empty, just as Captain Silver Dagger said. Uh, the rooms, as you open and go in, they're very, very simple. It's really just 
this is a place to sleep. You're really expected to just not be in there the whole time. Um, but you have a very simple bed. Uh, wooden looks really comfortable. Lots of blankets. Um, you've got a dresser that is attached to the ship. Um, you'll find that the bed is also attached to the ship because things move on the ocean. Um, and you have a little porthole window. What would you all like to do? Tyrion. Now is the perfect time to take the mushrooms. <laughs> <laughs> Lenora throws up. <laughs> no okay, con um, save. <laughs> no constitution save. No nothing. Just. <laughs> no. Just like, and she's just like. <laughs> uh, Astra, make a dexterity saving throw, please. <laughs> You did say you were her shadow. <laughs> I cannot hear you. I don't know why. I think that was a 15. But, um, did you turn the uh, sensitivity the opposite way? <laughs> 15. Uh, no, you, yeah, you, you jump out of the way. It's pretty easy to start hearing a, it was like, it's like having a dog. Just like, <laughs> the sound way too much of the night. Your, your heart just drops and you're just, oh, no. Exactly. Go outside. Go. <laughs> Chadwick. Are yes. you making up some tea? I am. Okay. If I'm going to be stuck here for a couple of days, then... Yeah, you will be stuck here for four days. Yeah, that's what I'm doing. I'm making some potent tea. All right. Chadwick's in the kitchen making some tea. And you all can kind of feel that the, the ship starts to take off. Um, Chadwick, what is your passive perception? Trash. 14. Oh, okay, that's enough. Um, oh, Astra's gone. Okay, as you're walking down the corridor, and you go into the kitchen, you start making tea, you see a furry someone at the end of the hall. Oh, Flower, do you want to describe you? yourself? <laughs> what you look like? <laughs> Is a massive, like six foot tall cat. It's a, it's a tabaxi, um, <laughs> and it's an Oriental short hair tabaxi. So if you've ever seen them, they're the weirdest looking cats. Like they have really long faces and huge ears. Um, Whoa! <laughs> <laughs> Googling. I'm Googling. Hold on. Totally, I totally and, Googled and then, it. Oh my god! And then I love they it. Don't point to them pictures because it just works but um I the panic it. attention kind of works but so I like the uh, ears. just like yeah. <laughs> eyes just like <laughs> like, so, like six oh, feet tall you said six feet tall but because they have those very long legs just like all limbs it's a very <laughs> awkward weird like <laughs> slender man cat <laughs> 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 Oh, hi there. Or, uh, sorry, I gotta work on my ship talk. Ahoy! <laughs> Ahoy! What you see is a large, gray-skinned, uh, furbolg with a huge, flat, no pink nose and long, droopy cow ears. He's eight um, feet tall. I am eight and a half feet tall. Oh. <laughs> um, so I'm like hunched over to the stove, like. <laughs> I love this woman. <laughs> ah, hello. Where are we going? Oh, <laughs> uh, um, did your captain not tell you where we are headed? Um. Uh, hold on. 
on. Let me think. Um, it's the the fierce woman, isn't it? Or is it is it the dude? Is it the hot dude? You're the first being I've seen. What does the captain do? Um. Probably sleep all day. I look. I gotta be honest. I don't know much about ships. Uh, but if I was the, in charge, I would sleep all day. Uh, so hey, hey, do you want do you want something to eat? Do you want something to drink? I'm making some tea. Um, I'm gonna make some casserole right now. All right, yeah. Um, it'll be ready in about, like, five minutes. It just needs to get a little hotter. As soon as you say casserole, Artarian's head just leans out from his <laughs> his cabin. Did you say casserole? I did, I did. Um, you know that caber rat? Y yes. I got some nice shellfish in that cave. Sweet. like that. Mossy mushroom shellfish casserole. Oh, I. Are we all inside? Hi, new person. Yeah, in your rooms or wherever you want to be. Yeah, this is. Uh, wandering around. Sorry, Sounds what was your bad. name again? Flower. 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 And like, well, nice to meet you, Flower. Like a six foot, like, radius around everybody. <laughs> like, cat behavior. <laughs> 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 My name's closer. Chad. Oh, this is gonna be wonderful. <laughs> Most people call me Chadwick, though. Actually, nobody in the group calls me Chadwick, but <laughs> My name is Chad. Chadwick. Oh, Chadwick. What's that? <laughs> gonna say that Lenora is gonna rush out, puke like on the side, like <laughs> out the whatever. And then I'm, can I, like, I see this cat, <laughs> and then I will immediately go to Flower. And so Lenora has no concept of personal space, so she will immediately get as close as she humanly possible, like, as close as she can, she's gonna look up at Flower, the book. The, With, the like, book. probably puke. <laughs> and then she's just gonna, like, <clears throat> pull out a piece of bread <laughs> and give it to Flower. Don't, Real don't. quick, I want Arterian and Lenora to each describe what Flower sees. <clears throat> oh, right. Um, so Lenora is, like, four-something. She's a short, um, half-elf. Um, she is... So she has, like, layers and layers and layers of clothing, so you don't quite know her size, because she just, she's mostly just robes and robes, so usually her, like, clothes are, like, up to here, because she just puked her, like, right here. <laughs> and it's just layers of, like, black clothing, she has two buns, giant round glasses, um... And she constantly is pulling stuff out of her clothing, and usually it's bread. Um, so, yes. As Lenora, the child, runs up to you, you, you see me come out of my cabin, and it's this enormously shouldered minotaur with these horns that come out, like, straight out and then up really hard, like, in really intense. He has black fur all over and red eyes um and he's about seven foot tall um just this ripped guy and he always has his shield and his flail and he's going up to lenora as she like rushes at you and he's just like lenora do not forget the exercise use your book draw So, like, flail and shield in hand? Yeah, yeah, or, like, whipped over my shoulder or something. <laughs> or there's, like, a small, um, 
It's almost like a hook that comes off of my belt, and I'll hang it by the chain there. But usually I do, he does like just carry his shield on his arm. Thank, thank you. Um, what type of... What type it's of flower? Card. <laughs> um, well, my full name. <laughs> it's a good name, by the way. <laughs> <laughs> full name. Flowers on the grave. So I get to decide. So it's that kind of flower. What kind of flower would you put on a grave with a name? Ayahuasca. A dead one. It's a flower, right? <laughs> a dead one. <laughs> you may have missed the point of the exercise. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, no, I was just clarifying. I apologize. Um, no disrespect. I just um, wanted to make sure I didn't miss the, the type of flower. Okay, yes, yes. Um I guess it's like my thing, it's not too <laughs> super exciting. Yes, I would I was Dark gonna ask road. earlier what <laughs> your clothes are like and if they're like different or is it armor? Uh what a character. <laughs> um Yeah. yeah. Arm armor. Both sides look like armor. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, you're screwed. All I'm dark about is puss in boots. Enormous puss in boots. Ginormous puss in boots. With giant boots. boots. <laughs> That's how I imagined. <laughs> I did this in Hero Forge earlier, so I'm just going to go ahead and end it down now. Yeah. Sweet. Hell yeah. Yeah, Arterian also um, has this helmet that he wears. It has holes for his horns. But then it has this little like insert that goes into the helmet, and it's this really creepy mask. Um, I'm not sure if my camera can catch this properly. Nope, it can't. Maybe if I unblur. Unblur it. Let's see. I don't think it's gonna make a difference, but it's close. Like it, it doesn't do it justice, of course. No, it's not good enough. My my camera's ass. Well, did he even try to refocus it? No, it doesn't like have a focus on it. Doesn't it have a manual focus? What the fuck? No. Don't you have a picture of it? Where the I mean, it looks from? creepy. Right? Yeah, it does look creepy. It though. does definitely look creepy. Let me see if mine will work. <laughs> Show them Chad. FYI. Um, Mark, oh my God. You're, like our stream on the stream, you have your yeah. There you go. <laughs> <laughs> Not oh too bad. Oh my gosh! Flowers. Does it, does it matter for you guys? <laughs> oh my God! Right yeah, that's pretty good. That looks good. No way. Yeah. What is my? I never took it. I don't know if I ever put this. And now I am out of focus. Super bad. <laughs> Can we drop okay. pictures into the chat or not really? Yeah. Really? Probably. Probably. Yeah. Probably. I don't know how. I don't know. Drop it in character info. <laughs> yes, that's where I put flowers. Oh my god, the picture of flowers. In character info, if you go all the way up to the top, that's a fan art that I found um, that is fairly close, other than the mask part. I went into the Arrakis on accident. <laughs> and I just saw the can't really like. <laughs> uh, you can't really see it either. The oh, arrows. I love that. I like that. Uh, okay. Hey, Crow, Elwin, and Astro, what are what are y'all doing? I'm chilling in my room. Like. Throwing some flowers in there. It's 
real peaceful. I got the little like porthole thing open. Got some like sea breeze happening. I'm I'm not paying attention to anything. <laughs> nice. Well deserved relaxation. Mm. Astro, what are you up to? Um, I'm looking, I'm walking around the ship, looking for amenities, either a bath or a shower. <laughs> um, you know what? There is. There is. Um, you go around, and you don't really find you find some like basic showers and lavatories like near the center there they're real basic very small stalls with some drain holes um but you're not quite sure how you get there but you find yourself standing in claire's quarters and they're nice like she's got a king-size bed in here it's got like four posters and curtains and you know it's really nice she's got a big desk um and you do see that there's a bathroom and you can just you just get the glimpse of the edge of a clawfoot tub Ooh, I, i'm sold i want to try it all right yeah you <laughs> go into uh into claire's bathroom it's empty um yeah and there's there's a pretty sweet setup in this in this bathroom. You've got your clawfoot tub. There's you know a sink and a, and a toilet. Um, you know quite quite nice amenities in here. There are some plants that are hanging. There's a um, there's a Hawaiian jasmine that's kind of growing uh, in the there's like a a giant window to the back. There's a you know it's flowering. It smells real pretty. That sounds really nice. I'm gonna take a bath because I feel like I've seen. It. <clears throat> I mean, all of you were just in a fish. <laughs> <laughs> You're probably also yeah. smelling like um, Lenora's puke. <laughs> it's hot, Gavin. <laughs> hot Gavin. Hot Gavin <laughs> smells hot. Um, <laughs> so, yeah, you also find that there are like a bunch of different bottles that are like different types of bubbles. Bubble bath. Mm. Bubble bath. Yeah. Prettiest one, and then okay. take a bath, and then right. yeah, that's um, that's what I'm gonna do. Cool, cool. Yeah, your bath. Um, so you, so the the prettiest one is this like, um, sort of teardrop shaped bottle, and you drop a few uh, drops of this like incandescent golden liquid, and it causes these shimmering bubbles to appear on the surface, and they it looks like somebody just made a bunch of bubbles out of glitter. Now you're in there chilling. Crow, what are you doing? Um, I'm wondering if I can like retcon just a little bit to before sure. everyone met out in the kitchen. Yeah. Um, I would like to flip my hood up and I wanna slide a hand, um, Todd, but I wanna I wanna put something in his pocket, not take something out. Okay. Yeah, roll a slide of hand check. So with I have a normal advantage on stealth, but then with my elven hood I get advantage on stealth do i get double advantage on stealth yeah you do um uh as susan mark how did we discuss doing double advantage last time i think it was in next campaign add in we plus two plus two to the roll yeah so it's advantage and then both right, rolls get plus two as well okay. plus two oh okay so advantage plus two yeah plus your um you know modifiers and everything okay so that's uh 22 okay chadwick passive perception you get well, disadvantage. You said 14 you oh, okay. get me. yeah i mean i mean i guess it doesn't matter <laughs> yeah <laughs> hey you slip something into his pocket yeah i'll send you it uh, in the chat you can choose to share it or you cannot but that's what it's in me? Yeah, I'm slipping something into your pocket. I'm not gonna check that until I have a reason to check my inventory. By the way, 
Okay. Because right yeah, now yeah. I am cooking some motherfucking tea. I'm That's... on a motherfucking mission. <laughs> That's fine. Whenever you check your pockets, is I, okay. I get I put it in there. I'm surprised. <laughs> I'm, I'm excited to be surprised. <laughs> Okay. Uh, it's been five minutes. Well, I don't. I don't notice you at all, huh? No, I leave. I'm like, Arterian, Arterian, you want casserole and tea? Just casserole. Um, I, this was before everybody came in. I retcon. I don't I left, typically so I left have I tea. Nice. You will or will not have tea. I don't usually have tea. Mm. Uh, are you more a coffee person? Usually, and blood, sweat, and tears. <laughs> but uh, usually, blood. Dude, you should try the tea. It will, it will do wonders for your mind, man. Can, can you roll a persuasion or deception check? For, and I just want to see if Arterian will just like go for it or not. <laughs> <laughs> Chad is like. Like every boomer's drug dealer, like he's he's too trustworthy. Like I I know what he's doing, but <laughs> Arterian probably doesn't. Um, <laughs> that do not exist anymore. Too. Okay, yeah. Um. Yeah, sh sure. You know, you let me have some casserole. I'll try some of your tea. How strong do you like your tea, my friend? I I really don't know. You'll have to. Judge my character on this. Alright, uh, you'll get the first pour. Um, the first pour is usually the weakest. Uh, you gotta bloom your tea first. So you, most people just toss the first pour out. Um, but yeah, here. So you'll you'll get the first pour. Um, I'll get the second, and then um, flower, flower power. We'll get the third. Alright. Uh, no one else is around, right? Lenora's there. <laughs> Lenora. <laughs> Lenora, do you want some tea? <laughs> oh, shit. <laughs> It'll help settle you. He's nah, a child. <laughs> if you're already throwing up, you probably don't want any tea. I'll take the fourth cup, too. <laughs> Pour the extra anyway. <laughs> um... Would I smell the casserole minutes. cooking? It's about 30 minutes out. So okay. probably you will in 30 minutes. minutes. Yeah, it's after a few minutes you can start smelling the casserole. Okay. Yeah, so if, if like, once it's close to, to done, I'll wander out and be like, who's cooking? <laughs> smell food! So my favorite thing! <laughs> Wait, um, I asked it, and I, of course, again, I was on mute, but did did we do a long rest? Did I miss that? Not yet. So. Not yet? Oh my god, can we please do a long rest? You could go to sleep if you want. She's just gonna, like, pass out on deck. It's the only solution for motion sickness, truly. <laughs> She's just, just like, gonna curl up in a corner. She's just gonna pass out. Like, so all you see is, like, her bun sticking out. Under so she's, like... Under her little, her little bagel, and all you see is her buns, and then just like layers of clothing. She's just like <laughs> snoring and passed out in a corner. I will ball up my somewhat dirty but very elegant bear cloak and put it under your head as a pillow. <laughs> you imagine like you're like this with the pillow here. Like, I know. I was like. <laughs> <laughs> I feel like it'd be huge. <laughs> <laughs> All right. So those of you who are taking, who are drinking the tea, um, I would like. I have no idea what this is gonna do to you guys. I'm sorry. <laughs> <laughs> um, I'm, really, I'm here for casserole. I'm I'm here to witness. <laughs> Shut up. If you were to come up, I would I'm offer you it. tea. No, it's totally true. <laughs> she probably would say yes, but not tonight, Satan. Not tonight. <laughs> not tonight, Satan. It's nice to leave your options open for Satan. Satan yeah. Wick. Satan well, Wick. I think she would be more curious to see what it does to Arterian, you know, because <laughs> Elwyn's not a stranger to m mushrooms, but since she's a druid, but like, I think it would be, she'd be 
it, maybe have a little bit, but not enough to. <laughs> Um, Chadwick, are you using your new tea set? I am, yes. Okay. Did I give you stats on your tea set yet? You did not. I have no idea what is okay. in your tea set. Excellent. Ooh, more exciting. Excellent. Um, all right. I would like Chadwick, Flower, and not Game Master, um, Arterian, to each roll me a, D, uh, 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 a constitution saving throw, please. That's good for me. That's good for me. I don't, I don't want it. <laughs> 18. No, 17. <laughs> Thank you. Nice. Chadwick. 17. Ooh. Three fails. Ooh, oh, wow. Okay. <laughs> Holy Using shit. Using the T-set. Using the T-set. Okay. Um, I would now like for each of you to roll a D100. A what? A D100. Um, so, are, do you have real dice or are you using... I, I have yeah. real dice. Oh, excellent. Yeah, D100. No modifiers. 57. That'll be a big old eight. So 70. 70, okay. Um. I'm gonna send you each a uh, heart message with with this. Uh, let's jump to Ellen Crowe Astro while I'm typing the stuff up. Do something. Um, Astro's gonna get out of the bath and go to the kitchen where the food smells yummy. All right. You're muted, Ellen. Ellen? You're on mute. <laughs> you have Three years of COVID and I still leave myself on mute. <laughs> <laughs> Remarkable. Uh, yeah, come have a seat here next to me, Astrid. They um, they had some tea, some of Chadwick's tea, so Arterian had some. <laughs> a, di a dinner and a show? Dinner and a show. <laughs> and I'm, so now that I'm in the kitchen, I'm going to realize that, like, Flower is here. And, like, all of a sudden be like, wait a minute, I don't know you. Who are you? Who, who are you? You're, you're, you're a, I, I've, wait, I'm, I'm going to be bitches very confused <laughs> for a second here to like get through it and be like, hi, I'm Elwyn. <laughs> I, I just go and pull into the cat bag. So like pupils huge. <laughs> Flower just bolts out of the room. <laughs> <laughs> like, full zoomy. <laughs> Out of the kitchen, onto the deck, and, and just like end to end. Like, <laughs> no one can get close. <laughs> well, like catnip, like kind of, yeah. crazy. <laughs> okay. And eventually, after several minutes, we'll, like wander back in, <laughs> like sit back down. <laughs> Hi. Yeah, I I hi. <laughs> Sorry about that. <sighs> I don't know what just happened. Okay. I'm flowers on the gray. It's very nice to meet you. 
you weren't you you're not the first tax cab i've met but it's been a while so it's yeah it's nice to see what are you doing here did you sneak aboard or are you friends with the captain or what's what's happening here i saw the ship it looked different than anything i'd been on before and i wanted to see and then it left land <laughs> That curiosity, you know, it'll, <laughs> it'll, it'll, it'll get you. Yeah, it'll get you. Uh, well, I'm not entirely sure where we're going. I'm, we're going to an island to stop a crazy person from doing bad things. Um, but I don't, you know, I'm not real great with geography. I just kind of wander and figure out where I am. So Elwyn has short hair like mine, but it's red. And she's got like some piercings, but she, um, <laughs> I always use this reference because I can't think of anything else, is right. Van Helsing, the movie yeah. Van Helsing with Hugh Jackman. And he's got like all the leather stuff on with like the belts and the straps and the, you know, there's like some weapons tucked in and stuff. So she's got lots of pockets. And so that's, that's what she looks like. And she rarely wears anything else. And it's probably pretty smelly, but... Um, but yeah, so, um, that's, uh, yeah, that's, well, it's very, it's nice to meet you, Flower. Welcome. We're, uh, welcome. I guess you're on board with this adventure now. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Quite literally. <laughs> Dad joke. <laughs> Someone put it in. Someone put it in. <laughs> yes, the longer like it's around people, the more kind of calm down and chill. <laughs> What's going on? Are you on the ship too? What are you just hoping to find? I mean, you don't you don't have to ignore me like that. I know. <laughs> I know it's been rough out here, but who's anybody? Anybody gonna check on Chad? Is Chad addressing anybody? I am facing the wall, <laughs> <laughs> and I'm just uh, from your point of view. I'm talking to the wall. Uh, Quick, um, somebody in the chat redeem the sound uh just fyi we can uh refund you for that one our sound alerts are off what sound Andy was doesn't need that. i'll try to replicate it because i think it was the wah wah or something it was, it was, it was. Yeah. no 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 it was the was drum dad joke, joke. Oh. yeah okay so definitely aware two drums and a cymbal fall off a cliff <laughs> That was good. That was really good. Hey, <laughs> whoa, dude, just come join the party, you know? We're all hanging out here. One second, this this. No, we should all be. They're sad over. Here. She's sad. A I need to... part of this. We're gonna go to the volcano and we're gonna kill people that need to die. <laughs> 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 your horns. <laughs> yeah. Look at them. Look at your horns right now. <laughs> do, do you think my yeah. horns are funny? And I'll go I go over to this chair and I just like sit in it like this. <laughs> and I'm looking up like this. Where did you think you were gonna go today? <laughs> I don't know what he's saying, man. I really don't get it. <laughs> Dude, I think he speaks another language. I mean, look at him. He doesn't look like any of us. Tyrion, do check your DMs uh, throughout this. Um, what you all see is, it's really incredible, actually. 
you don't know if like you just have really impeccable muscle control or what, but it like his legs are actually like up, like like they're they're not actually leaning on anything. <laughs> Oh my god. They're so cute. Were you also gonna fight Kite? Dude, I turned back to the wall. Did Kite do you wrong? Do you want to, like, bring up your grievances to him? And tell him he's been very bad? Yeah, Kite's uh, been a piece of shit. You should listen to Chadwick. Yeah, he, you know, maybe we can save him. You know, maybe instead of Kite the Corrupter, we can turn him into, like, Kite the Caresser. <laughs> <laughs> he can just give hugs. <laughs> To draw the line at caressing. I don't know what y'all are talking about, but I'm gonna have to to hop in there. I, who who are, you, who are you guys talking to? I on. really Natalie, don't. Are know. your mushrooms moving? They do. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Like, they bobble a little. I don't think I noticed. They are. Freak it out, man. Like, am I? Like, is this <laughs> It's just like I keep on staring and I keep on thinking that it's just like, you know, when you like look and you think that things are moving, but now yeah. I'm like, oh god, they are moving. Yeah, no, they are. You're right. Very subtly and slowly, so it makes you feel like you're crazy. Yeah, the little that is really the, creepy. The no, stars the star moving. Is, yeah. Noticed, yeah. Oh, I didn't even wow. notice that. Oh my god. Yeah. Okay. Sorry. We're all very tired, guys. <laughs> The hard the world. <laughs> the whole vibe. The whole vibe. <laughs> um, so, by uh, the way, I little... just put in Arterian into the character info out of Hero Forge. Um, that's as close as I could get it. Um, they've added a lot of new stuff to Hero Forge since I made mine. Holy shit. That's pretty intense, man. That's 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 pretty dope. I like that. He's a hardcore motherfucker. <laughs> that like He's right below hardcore. flower, it just looks disturbing. <laughs> flower is just like chilling. <laughs> if you don't know what we're talking about, go on and join our horrible. Discord. Oh yeah, wait. And how do you join man. our Discord? Wait. You go to I... Discord and hit join. Just kidding. Oh, I um, put command you'll... instead. I'm an idiot. Um, you can click that link uh, in the chat for those of you watching live. For those of you who are not, uh, our it's not Linktree, it's something else, but it's like Linktree, but you know, one of the other ones that's not Linktree. Um, we've got one of those, it's in our Instagram profile, it's in our Twitch about us section. Uh, and you can go and see all where we exist all over the interwebs, all in one place. He has been. He's he's been so bad. He's, he's a real piece of work. I just, you know, and Chadwick's always so nice. He thinks he can save him, man, but no. You know, there's a bit of Kite in all of us. I used to be Kite. Kite and me are the same. Don't listen to him. Chadwick is a good person, and he'll make you I casserole. Used I used to corrupt people. Is Flower also high? Yes. Yes. Oh. Like staring intently at the wall to be like, <laughs> you know, I wake up. <laughs> uh, Next one question. Just want to imagine, like, when cats are like trying to pat something. Yeah, that's what they do. That's <laughs> all I imagine. <laughs> yeah. Exactly. They're just like staring at things and then, like. I thought cats like, were the ones supposed to see ghost. <laughs> <laughs> mm -hmm. 
So yeah. do we, and the rest of us don't have any idea what they're seeing. Are they seeing like a, the same thing? Do I, do we, do I know that? We don't. I'm, I'm over know. here talking to the chair, man. Gotta drink the tea to find out. Look at this guy. I mean, he's such a wise individual. No, I'm not. It's just... No, not, not you, Chad. Stuff. I agree, you're not wise. I'm talking about this guy over here. And he's still sitting oh. in the chair, and he's looking at the person. <laughs> as you are tearing as you turn to look up at him, you realize nothing's there. And you get your faculties to come back. You're a little bit more aware now. Hey, where'd he go? <laughs> He's right there. Dude, that, that dragon's so cool. How, how was that, Arterian? Did you enjoy that? <laughs> I was talking to someone. Feel? I don't. Flower is there. You're there. Lenore is asleep now. Wait, where did that guy go? He was sitting in this chair. Chadwick, your hallucinations have stopped as well. Oh, okay. Nope. He's gone. He's not there. He wasn't there before. What do you know? Well, I know I couldn't see him. That's what I know. If so, you know, I'm funny. not saying you didn't see him, but I know that I didn't see him. Or Kieran, it was just your uh, your subconscious trying to talk to you. Did you learn anything? You little shit. You fucking gave me something, didn't you? <laughs> uh, no, you... Uh, what was uh, in the I'll casserole? Be... <laughs> uh, Nothing. It was delicious. Not your best, but really good. Well, yeah, I mean, <laughs> those fish people were kind of uh, emaciated, so there's not a lot on them. It's okay. No, it was good. Loved it. Yeah. <laughs> I tasted the blood of their victims. Hey, we ate the fish people? <laughs> <laughs> I don't know, Chad. Did you harvest the fish people? What the hell? <laughs> no, Chad wouldn't have done that. Well, <laughs> just, I used to say it's like that scene Rocky Horror where uh, Columbia leaves the room. Yeah. <laughs> when you said fish people, I was picturing like fishermen, like market, yeah. like fish people. <laughs> No, like actual fish people. Which was she that I'm like, I forgot about the actual fish people. <laughs> oh my god, that's so funny. Oh, oh she was you have new people. So that's what we're talking about in, in Roll Twenty. Love it. It's true. Oh, I, gotta, I gotta grab my Astro, that was an excellent yeah. question. <laughs> oh goodness. Uh. No. <laughs> yeah, um I don't usually use meat, but uh you know, on the on a boat, not a lot grows, so we got to use what we got to. It was it was good, yeah. Uh, but Arterian, did you learn anything about yourself? I learned that I'm going to kill Kite and that you might be him? I don't fucking know, man. You just kept yeah. saying that you were Kite. You were Kite. I what what do you mean you're Kite? Me and him are the same, essentially. We I used to, I'm hearing I this right, yeah, you. Elwin? Yeah. Yeah. I think so. I mean I, I didn't you know, you, you guys weren't making that much sense. I'm not going to lie. It's hard to, like, follow when you're having an entirely other conversation. It's a hard job. And she kind of just, like, trails off because you're all, like, looking at her. <laughs> it was me, like, <laughs> I poke Astra to, like, back me up here. <laughs> I don't know why you guys are looking up. I 
I kept looking in the wall. Yeah, you you were talking to people who weren't there. Yeah. I made my fortune making other people sick. Yeah, well, you're about to get rich because you make me sick. <laughs> I'm sorry, I didn't mean to laugh at that. I'm sorry. I I I want to do better. You messed with my mind, man. It's the only thing I trust. I. It didn't make you sick. You feel fine, right? Yeah, where's hot Gavin? I have an arm wrestle to attend to. I'm gonna just, like, big, big Minotaur just stumble down the hallway of the ship trying to go find Gavin. Bashing into the wall. <laughs> Okay. Yeah, I mean it's not hard to find. Um, Gavin is uh, is up on the deck, kind of directing people. Um, I thought he was in his see... room. Oh yeah, you're right. You're right. Gavin. Okay. Probably... Then before that happens, I want to do yeah. what I'm doing because I've not been at this dinner yeah. party. Yep. So I went to find Hot Gavin first. Excellent. Oh really? Okay. <laughs> Let's do it. I've got my I've got my hood up, and I want to sneak into Hot Gavin's room. Okay, cool. Um, make your stealth check. Thirty-three. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, nobody sees you. Um. You look like you just got burned. <laughs> <laughs> Ow! <laughs> 33! As I, like, sneak into his room, what do I see if I, just before, I, upon, upon arrival? Yeah, so he's got a couple of windows in his room. His room is right next to um, Claire's, um, the main cabin. So, like, basically the way it works is uh, you have kind of a raised area where the steering wheel thing is, I don't know nautical terms, um, but it's a steering wheel. Uh, and immediately below it is where the captain's and first mate's quarters are. Captain's quarters are like on the right, and they're much bigger. First mate's quarters are a little smaller on the left. So he's got windows that go to the back and the side of the ship. Again, don't know nautical terms, so it's the side and back, um, the right side and the back side. Uh, and let's see. So your left looking in the right side of the stage right. Um, and yeah, he's got a, like a queen size bed. He's in it. Um, there's like a, a, a wet compress on his head. Um, and he's got, let's see, he's got a desk in there. He's got a dresser. It's he awake? Small. He is not awake. He's asleep. Okay. Um. I want to, like, go to the foot of his bed and kind of, like, creep up and just be like, Hot Gavin! <laughs> <laughs> and, um, I want to use, um, I want to use Intimidation. Ooh, okay. On, on Hot yeah. Gavin. Sure. Oh, that's a natural one. <laughs> <laughs> he like opens an eye and he's like, "Oh hi!" And kind of just like turns over. <laughs> um. Okay. Then I'm gonna get um. I'm gonna get on the foot of his bed and I'm gonna like like just like lay like this. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Okay. <laughs> this my intimidation didn't work. Um. <laughs> uh. And I just wanna be like, so you are dead. <laughs> He's like, uh, I kind of was, I guess you could say. That probably sucked, huh? I mean, it, it wasn't really pleasant. Would, doesn't that make you mad that someone, someone killed you? Uh, yeah. Yeah, it makes me real mad. Wouldn't you want to get revenge on someone who killed you? I mean... I think all the creatures were dead by the time I woke up. 
there's always more trying to trying to come after you. And what if you could protect yourself from being killed again? Oh, well that would be pretty cool. How do you do that? Well, I have a I have a secret Get that I can script. share with you if you're willing to participate. Oh, okay. Sure. See, the way it works is you buy into this and then you start getting benefits and then I get benefits from your benefits. And then it kind of is like a trickle up effect. Okay. So... But then we all benefit from joining the torturer's flock. Oh, the torturer's flock? That sounds Have intriguing. Have you heard of Asmodeus? No. Has he? Well, he can, no. he, can grant, he can grant you powers. He'll save you from being killed. He'll help to heal you, keep you from harm. All you need to do is join his flock. Hmm. Go ahead and make your persuasion check. Well, creepy real fast. <laughs> Crow's inventing the MLM. <laughs> <laughs> Pyramid schemes. <laughs> Love it. Um, if you sign up three friends today. <laughs> he's like, he's like, you know, dying. Dying was real rough. That was that was real. Oh. I mean, all there was was like this blinding white light that was like, it burned. It like burned real hard. I didn't like it. I didn't like it at all. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. So how do I do this? How do I sign up? Um, I'm going to give him the book. Okay. I'm pretty sure you're supposed to do something with this. I can't read, but I'm pretty sure that all the information is in there. I can't read either. <laughs> so, um, that's, that's unfortunate. But, uh, you know, I'm sure, I'm sure I could find somebody who could read this if you want me to try. Okay. Yeah, the more the barrier. Okay. Yeah. Yeah, I'll hang on to this and, uh, I'll, I'll, I'm sure I can find somebody on this ship. I don't know. Claire's a little bit. She, she might be too hard to convince, but, you know, um, Stephen, who is up in the crow's nest, he, he can read. Did you say yeah. Stephen? I'm a nest? I did. <laughs> Stephen. 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 <laughs> Stephen. <laughs> yeah, um, but I'll have to talk to him tomorrow, because, like, kind of hurting. Up in my nest. Yeah, yeah, he does all the navigation stuff. He can read maps. I'm sure he can read a book. Okay. And then I just disappear without saying anything. <laughs> Do you? Did you take your book, or is, is Gavin? Does Gavin still have it? I think Gavin has the book. Okay. Cool. Okay, you disappear. Crow's nest. We can do. We can do that later. But I'm gonna go. I'm gonna head. Okay. Do I notice okay, Crow so... walking out? Perception check at disadvantage. Okay. 17 and 12. Let me see what my modifier is. Crow, roll your stealth. Please. Just a 12. Just a 12. Yeah. I mean... I'm pretty sure like Crow has an 11 like... <laughs> to stealth. Yeah, 32. <laughs> yeah, no, you don't see, you don't see Crow at all. Shut up. I don't know why you all keep, keep trying. <laughs> hey, um, hey, hey, Gavin. Oh. You in, you in here? Yeah. Yeah. How, how do you feel? You up for a little competition? Um, 
I literally just died an hour ago. <laughs> do do I look like I'm up for competition? Dying I'm is the best down. part of being alive, Gavin. Don't you know this? It absolutely was not. Well, here I will not do it again. How does this? If I can help it. <laughs> how does this feel? My hands get this like crazy red glow around them. I'm gonna cast Lay on Hands on him for 35 HP. <laughs> okay. Uh, yeah. How? Good. How about now? A, a little competition yeah. sound <laughs> sound like some fun. <laughs> yeah. Yep. Let's do it. Why not? What do you want to do? Um, it's time for an arm wrestle. Oh. Damn. All right, let's do it. Okay, I'll meet you on deck. Okay. <laughs> All right, so you're going to start going out on deck? What are the rest of you doing? I am trying to reach out to the metaphysical and see if there's okay. anyone on this ship. Like, I, not that I have this ability or anything, mind you. Like, I just want to... <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to reach out to the metaphysical, I think. <laughs> I was like, cool, just like divine sense or something. Like, <laughs> no, no, no. I'm just going to be like, is there anyone on this ship who needs redeeming of their past evils and who wants to be saved? I went blatantly ignoring you. <laughs> I just like sit cross legged in the kitchen. It's like. Who am I supposed to reach out to? And then I'll reach in my pockets. I want you to make a um, perception check, please. Perception, alright. You sure it's not insight? It's the same either way, I don't really don't care. <laughs> um, it could be insight if you want. Uh, that'll be a dirty 20. 30, 20. Um, you feel some energy behind you. It's like someone is standing behind you. Open my eyes and look behind me. You don't see anything. I'm going to turn 180 and just start walking. Okay. Toward that direction of the ship. See, the first person I encounter. Okay. Anyone. Um, well, who's still in the kitchen? <laughs> okay. Yeah, maybe. Ellen really okay. isn't going to go watch the competition between Arterian and Hot Gavin? <laughs> <sighs> <laughs> I'm like food or hot Gavin? Food, hot Gavin, <laughs> really hard. I mean, you can take your food up to the yeah deck. dinner like, and a show. Not against the rules. <laughs> yeah, I guess I'll do that. I'll just like okay. grab some more casserole and like eventually just like yeah head up head up to the deck. Yeah, <laughs> fair enough. <laughs> okay, Chad. You see, uh, um, there's a crew member coming upstairs from, from the bottom deck. You. Carrying some rope. Ah. <laughs> you can be a better person. You, you sure? are what you were. I oh. promise you. Oh. Well, thank you. Uh, I quite like that. That kind of makes me feel like, like the shitty stuff I've done is it's not so shitty anymore. It's always shitty, and you must always remember oh. that. <laughs> but well, you can well, always now I feel be better. Shitty. Yeah, you yeah. You can always be the better person and become what you want to. It's 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 fine. Oh, <laughs> look at Chad. So, so so I could be captain of this ship one day. You could one day. Just don't go about it by shitty means. Oh, sorry. I, I shouldn't, like, kill Captain Silverdagger. Of course not. You're trying to... Just checking. 
you're trying to be the per. I hope you're trying to be a better person than you were. We uh, we always got to look toward yeah. tomorrow. Anytime yeah, yeah, we're better yeah. than we were yesterday is a winning day. Am I right? Oh, I love that. I love that all over. Yeah, I'm into that. I could be better tomorrow than I was today. I, I, I don't know you. What's your name? I almost said Chad. <laughs> <laughs> Chad, it's good to see you. You're just like me. Good job. Holy I'm shit. Uh, my name is Lens. Lens. Yeah. No one would listen to me, and I really, just really feel like I got to get this off my chest. But okay. I used to, I used to kill people. Oh shit. And now I, I did. I, I used to kill people and got money from it. But oh, you know what? Shit. I just want to be <laughs> a better person now, and I've found so much success with it. I know you can do the same too. You want to be friends? Wow. Yeah, yeah. I want to be friends. We'll keep each other accountable. Let's we'll be friends. Both be, be good people, exactly. better people tomorrow than we were today. Exactly. We'll have check-ins. It, it, <laughs> I'm so thankful I found you. Oh, me too, man. Me too. You changed my entire outlook on life. Get a group started. Insight check. Do it. Okay. The twenty. Yeah, he's telling the truth. Okay, cool. <laughs> you, you literally changed this kid's life. Fuck yeah! <laughs> Success. <laughs> he's like, I know some real shitty people on this boat. We could get them together and have sort of like a, uh, you know, a, a, a group, a top group. Yeah, it'll be a like circle. A I'll bring coffee. MLM for <laughs> like oh, I... rivalry MLM. <laughs> oh, I was, I was thinking coffee like oh, no. AA. <laughs> no, I, I mean, yeah, man, we let let's get together a group and see how we can make the biggest positive change in the world with us with enough people i you know there's nothing we can't do yeah we'll call a group shitheads anonymous <laughs> <laughs> shitheads anonymous yes <laughs> or how about wait i got one better huh. what about assholes anonymous I love it. Assholes anonymous. I mean, we won't be very anonymous. Because, uh, you know, everyone on the boat knows each other. But, you know, we can do it. Yeah. All right. Well, I got to get back to work. Uh, I've got this rope. Um, I'm supposed to go give it to Steven. Um, I'll help you. Uh, he whatever doesn't you have do today, I'll help you out. I have, I have a completely free day. so. Oh, nice. I'll just yeah, go with so you. So, Steven has a habit of, like, falling off the crow's nest. Uh, so so this rope is to like tie him there. So that when he falls off, he's really tall, you see, his center of gravity, real <laughs> high. So when he falls off, the whale just swing and it'll it'll be like he's flying. And, and you're you know you're doing uh you're doing good already. Yes. Let's go do it. <laughs> Can I transition to mine? <laughs> yep. Your okay. turn. <laughs> I wanna I wanna use my knives as like ice like ice picks, like how people climb up like ice walls. I want to use my my daggers to like climb up this crow's nest. Cool, cool. Um, uh, make an no. acrobatics check. Yes. Twenty four. Yeah, you do it. No problem. Um. Does Steven turn to me? Uh. Are you still stealthy? It doesn't matter. Um, You've got a natural one. I'm not just trying to be. Um, I pop my head up. I want to see what he okay. does or says. You know, Stephen has a really high perception. Um, it's literally his job up here. So he's going to kind of turn and be like, oh. And then, like, continue looking out. <laughs> I'm going to whisper in his ear. I'm going to be like, and I'm gonna push him out of the crow's nest. <laughs> He's here. Ah! <laughs> oh, that is a fail. 
Okay. Um, yeah, he crashes to the to the ground, and a couple of people. You look over, and a couple of people are like, "God damn it, fucking demon! What the fuck?" And they they're like going over, and uh -oh. you know they're like, "Someone, someone get the cleric, get the cleric over here." And after a minute, you see this like, um, this this uh, Tobacco. elven dude with red hair and white robes come out from below the deck and come over and start doing some healing on him. Does he go to see Hawk Gavin? No. He's after he's healed, he starts climbing back up to the crow's nest. I just threw my pencil. <laughs> Whatever. Yeah. He goes back. People go back to their posts. The cleric goes back down to to his quarters. Okay. Yeah, well, if he's gonna try and climb up back up the crow's nest, I'm gonna throw my dagger at him. Okay. Eighteen. Yeah, that hits. That's nine points damage. Okay. And I say, go see Hot Gavin! <laughs> oh, why? Why? Why would you do that? Fine, fine. But you have to keep a watch. Keep an eye out. Or anything. These are gonna be dangerous waters here in a little bit. So it's all up to you. <laughs> and I like okay. I like walk around in a circle a few times and I kinda like <laughs> and I sit down in the, <laughs> the middle of it. And I think I could probably just like maybe just barely see my eyes like poking out from the top. <laughs> yep, yep. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, well he's gonna go off to see Gavin. Anybody else? Anybody else want to do something? Before we get to the to the arm wrestle? I think I'm just like sitting next to the Amira now. <laughs> like, chill vibe. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Please good. don't puke on me. Please don't puke, puke on me. <laughs> it's hard to get puke out of fur. Please don't <laughs> do it. <laughs> Cool. Okay, we're gonna go to the go to the arm wrestle. Um, some people pull the table out. Um, I pull the table out and they set it up right in the middle. Um, you can see Captain Silver Dagger at the helm of the ship. I think I got that one right. Um, driving the steering wheel. <laughs> 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 got that one right too and, um, <laughs> and uh, she's kind of like chuckling at, at like what's going on um, you see that that cleric come on out uh, so greater subscribe thank you for gifting that sub um, thank you yeah. Yeah. I'm, I'm just gonna, but it's not gonna. No. Arterian will win this arm wrestle for you. <laughs> yes. <laughs> they will do it for you. Okay, so this um, arm wrestle, yeah. So that cleric comes back up. He, he's been called, um, you know, to oversee this. So he kind of like, he rolls up the sleeves of his right robes and he's like, all right, uh, you know, you know the rules of this arm wrestle. Uh, first one down loses. Don't push yourself too hard now, Gavin. I don't want you to hurt yourself. It's It's been a pretty rough day for you. I just need some competition, and it wasn't going to happen with Chadwick today. Bring it on. <laughs> okay, so I want you to make your first stealth roll. Strength. I mean, strength roll. I'm, I'm used to, to Crow having all the rolls. <laughs> 14. Okay. Oh, dang. He also got a 14. Oh, okay. 
podcast. Um, oh. All right, so you're just like, oh, go on, go on for it, go on for it. Do another stealth. I mean, strength. God damn. And a strength roll. 16. Ooh. Eight. <laughs> so you get him one, one part closer. He's like, oh, no, you won't get, you won't win this one. Strength. Twelve. Sure you did. Yeah, he got a six. <laughs> so you get him one more down. He's just hovering over the end of the table. Victory is in sight. But will you get this last strength roll? Victory gives me the ability to be called Hot Arterian of for the day. For the day. Natural <laughs> twenty. <laughs> Minus uh, in this <laughs> minus in this fucked up position, I cannot pull it down. Maybe maybe you can see it. No, you can't. <laughs> You truly are. There. You truly are hot, Gavin. <laughs> so hot. You cannot handle this hotness. Another strength check. Please tell me oh, he knows fireball. Twenty-three. Just to be hot. Oh no! Seventeen. And you slam his arm down on the table. Everyone roars and cheers. Um, a few people are like, "Damn it!" <laughs> And Hot Arterian rules the day! <laughs> you start hearing this chant, Hot Arterian, Hot Arterian, Hot Arterian. Claire is visibly rolling her eyes. <laughs> anyone else want to... No, no. Let's not take anyone from their work. I'm sorry for taking you from your sleep, Gavin. Just Gavin. <laughs> <laughs> Enjoy your rest. Oh. <laughs> you need your beauty sleep. Right. You can have hot the hot um, <laughs> title back tomorrow. I will be hot again tomorrow. <laughs> and you will be just Arterian. I am fine. And with he just that. like slumps back to his <laughs> to his quarters, and then, and then you see Stephen like running after him like a little yippy yap puppy. Like, hey, wait, wait for me, wait for me, Stephen. <laughs> <laughs> But he's like, oh, oh. and the the cleric's like, whoa, 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 hold it, hold it. Where'd that come from? What's going on? He's like, oh, no, ah, uh, just, just do it. So he just like rips the dagger out and does a a quick healing and. So the dagger's gone. Frozen. It was my, back in my. Oh, it was okay. Good, cool. So he just like heals it, and then he's gonna climb up to the crow's nest. Uh, why do you make a perception check? <laughs> it won't so, load! I have to go, guys. I gotta go pick up my kiddo. Okay, go pick up your kiddo! This Goodbye! So <laughs> See you all next week! Bye-bye! <laughs> Bye! Bye! Bye. Ah, okay. Um, you do not notice until you hear a boo right behind you. I stab him in the face. Ha! <laughs> you may roll to hit. Twenty-seven. Twenty-seven. Uh, yeah, that hits. Go ahead and roll some damage. Eight. Okay. Let's go like ah. He's like ah, catches it right <laughs> in his arm. Got reaction. Fair. I guess I deserve that. Can you not stab people on this boat, please? I've only you got so many healings in me. Pick up on me. This is my nest. No, yeah. Named after me. Oh, oh. It belongs to me now. Okay. I mean, you're more than welcome to take on the role of lookout for the rest of the journey. I'm sure that's fine. Just 
ease up on the, the shanking of the of the crew, please. Shake your buddies, I don't care. <laughs> the crew. So just just leave the crew alone. Okay. Enjoy your watch. He's gonna like <laughs> sit down. Sit. That's just so good. Great. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, what's anyone else doing for the rest of the day? Um, Arturian is basking in the glory. Okay, <laughs> Arturian is basking. Speaking of basking, that's close to bathing. What is what is Astra doing? <laughs> go to sleep. Go to sleep, yeah. Yeah, that's fair. That's fair. I imagine, like, having your hair, like, in, in curl... You know, curlers up by your horns, just like ready to go to sleep. <laughs> Wait, wouldn't the horns <laughs> act as curlers? You could just. Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yes. Like, shoop, like a beehive. <laughs> <laughs> yes, you have a, you have a faint uh, shimmer of gold all over you from your back. There's a couple okay. people Chad wants to talk to. Okay, okay. Let's uh, make flower, it. How about, okay, go for it. Flower, um, Astra, and Crow. Whoever I find. Okay, uh, you probably find um, Flower because Astra's asleep and Crow is in their nest. Flower, so... Uh, I couldn't help but uh, get a strange feeling from you. Um, what are you? Why are you on this boat? Uh, curiosity. I, uh, well, uh, you know what curiosity did, right? <laughs> <laughs> something that called to me and there are those times that you have to follow those feelings and this was one of them other times the feeling tells you to run well, you you'd no. mentioned something earlier about me being the first being you've seen and you trailed off on the boat oh not in like years or Ever. Never. Okay. No. I don't often see other beings. Sometimes. But often not a lot. Ooh. Done some uh, nefarious work, have you? sounds very nice to me. Uh, I think it's natural and inevitable. And whether or not it happens is not necessarily my job. You're an executioner. Some people need help. <laughs> That's also a very strong word. <laughs> you you, you don't like <laughs> I can. <laughs> it's not my first reaction necessarily. <laughs> Otherwise, you... I feel like many things would have gone differently today. <laughs> the fair. What do you typically do to earn yourself a uh, uh, living? A, a what? <laughs> uh, like like uh, you pay for things. I, I don't know. You don't necessarily have to. Like, it, myself, I, I don't really ever pay for shit. Again, it's not my first impulse to, to uh, 
use money to pay for goods and services. I believe in more of a collectivist sort of bartering, even exchange. Ah, <laughs> uh, I got you. You like, uh, give last will and testaments to people and you stay in their houses while sick people look after sick people and I you have. just go from house to house I have that's a facet <laughs> of uh, I think shepherding people to the other side there are more violent ways to do it when necessary uh, <laughs> not again that's not always necessary. <laughs> Interesting. Well, it must not be you. I, I, I'm looking for someone who's done some shitty things. But it sounds like you're all right. I like to think so, but I also think everything's a balance. <laughs> no one is completely not shitty. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I guess that depends on the spectrum, you know. Um, Chad scratches his arm a little bit. Um, all right. Oh, well, I've heard yeah, you it, say you're... that you think you are better than you were. Uh, no, not yet. But I've told myself I will be better. A work in progress. Yeah. Yeah, you could say that. Um, things like that. Uh, things that take a lot of work. Um, and it's not done until it's done, you know? I do know. Oh, hey. Uh, it, if you ever need anything want anything I I'll make sure I do my best to uh, accommodate you okay thank you I yep. will often you can... say it as... sorry uh, I was gonna say uh, you seem like a stowaway you can say you're with us that way you don't get in trouble thank you that had not occurred to me <laughs> <laughs> yeah, just just say you're with with us. Thank you. <laughs> Before Chad leaves, he's like, "Is she okay?" <laughs> <laughs> Here, I have yet to figure that one out. <laughs> I you just hear her snoring. She's just snoring. And again, all you see is like buns. <laughs> like the cartoon. Uh, her uh, troubles are not <laughs> mine to discuss, so we can talk about with that with her whenever she wakes up. Okay. I, I just meant right now. <laughs> but oh, yeah. No, no. She, okay. She'll be fine. I've traveled on a couple of boats. This happens. <laughs> Especially with children. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> That's great. And with that, we're going to call it a night. All right. um, you'll have three days of downtime. We're going to explore those three days next week. Um, come prepared with something that you want to get done in those three days. Uh, and if nothing, um, then that's fine too. I'm looking at you, Crow. <laughs> I checked my pockets. A, can we do a long rest? Are yes. We doing, okay, because... Yeah, we'll close out this day. <laughs> Great. And you all can have a long rest. So Lenora was only at like 10 and she had one point of exhaustion still from the last <laughs> so that's why yeah. she's... Oh, yeah. <laughs> yep, you need that. 
So yeah, you'll be. Or all she's there like tomorrow. out after she just threw up all over the place because she died. You know, right? <laughs> she did die. <laughs> I completely she forgot about mini that. died. Yeah, it was it was almost dead. You were nearly it was almost dead. Almost dead, dead. It was like a yeah. unconscious, almost, almost mostly dead. Yeah, <laughs> basically mostly dead. dead. <laughs> if you were alone, you were dead. <laughs> yeah. Yep. Oh yeah, definitely. That was a pretty intense yeah. battle. Yep. <laughs> was it? I didn't take a single point of damage. <laughs> <laughs> That's because you have an AC out the wazoo. Yeah, I didn't. I didn't. Take or because you didn't do shit. I didn't. I didn't really do shit. I was like, everyone, come back to the entrance, and then everyone ran in, <laughs> and then everyone just killed everything instead. <laughs> yeah. But, yeah. Feels bad. <laughs> so next week we're also here right yep one more week remote and then the week after we will be back in person next week we made it our, our me, like I said, me if, not you if you guys me, crave me. the physical um <laughs> sessions you guys can come to my house we can all Do sit you have together the mics um no but i can get one i mean i have the one mic that I have, but because the main issue is whether Shars can hear us. Yeah. Yeah. And and cameras, obviously. Need cameras. But... I got cameras. Cool. Yeah, and I have some too, but um yeah. Anyway. Cool, cool, cool. Yeah, we'll figure awesome. that out. And we'll see you. Cool. Well, thanks for tuning time. in, everyone. See you on Sunday. See you next time. 10 a.m. Yeah, do a point for Sunday. Um, for the Arrakis Conquest, where we will continue and finish out our boat extravaganza that has been going on. <laughs> and for those of you in my boats. Sunday campaign, we will probably have a session this Sunday, but we will probably not be streaming it. Okay. I am going to end the stream.